Hello and welcome to some more Train Simulator 2020 content and we're going to be doing the third and final test run going from Lowestoft all the way to Norwich. Same 37s as before and we just got to experience a new area of the route. But if you've got any route recommendations or trains you'd like to see me drive then please do let me know and I'll see what I can do. But if you'd like to uh, help me get along with some of these you can do so by supporting the channel by uh, donating to the PayPal link found down below. Any and all funds that go into that will go straight back into the channel uh, for future content, not only for this, but just for other projects I have in mind. I'm rather looking forward to this, seeing uh, the route from Lowestoft to Norwich, seeing if we take a different uh, way around and just seeing what's available to us. And of course, because we're driving in the 37s, what isn't to love? Now, I don't know anything about this one. This will be the first time I've done it, so I'll be experiencing it the same as you. So I don't know if there's going to be any dodgy speed limits, if we're going to have ridiculous waiting times at the station. Okay. Let us do that. Good timings, lowest off at uh, 14.12. Jesus Christ, we've got ages to wait yet. Oh, uh, blimey. Then Alton Broad. Then Summer Layton, then Hay Hadsco, then to Reedham, then Cantley, Brundle, Brundle Gardens, and finally Norwich. Please note that due to the platform length at Hadsco and Brundle Gardens, procedure is to not open the doors but to let anyone board slash disembark by using the guard's door on the BSO coach behind your loco. Please make sure this coach is lined up with a platform then to simulate what will occur in passenger service. Also, at these stations, you, didn't, you needn't wait for booked time. Okay. Well, we're running. That's all we're going to do. Strip lights. Headlights. Okay, there, hello. We've got turbo leaving. No oh, blimey. Seventy two seven one bound for Ipswich. Didn't even know we had someone back there. All right, let's just make sure the headlights are on. So it looks like it's going to be 47 four, Sorry, what's again? 47. 37 45 is going to be uh, leading the entire way. That's absolutely fine. Remove that. Okay. See that the gantry has just gone down. So now I, I last stopped when I was at the very end. So where does it actually want you to stop properly in this? Right down this end. Okay. Oh, blimey, we've gone ghost mode. Look at the fan. It's incredible. Okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's gone up anyway, so that's fine. 10 mile per hour limit as we uh, leave, so I presume that is for crossing over the points there, so I just need to be careful on there. I just love how long this platform is, that's mad. Well, I suppose what you do is you have long distance intercity services called here, you know, eight, nine cars in length that go from Lowestoft to uh, London Liverpool Street. So what they do is they run from here straight to Norwich and then go from there. That could be pretty cool. Okay, we're just going to sit here, really. We, there's nothing else we can do. As soon as we have to wait for a few minutes, no matter which way you look at things. I'm just hoping we haven't got ridiculous waiting times at uh, some of the other stations. It's just a clean run. So, I'm not being awarded points for accuracy, but they actually want me to... Is the Ah, oh, okay, it's there. So they want me to get that fully in line with the platform. So, in theory, do I then... If the platforms are short, do I have to then overrun with the loco just so the carriage gets in? I assume they don't mind if the loco 
isn't in the same area as the platform itself. We are going to assume so. Now I don't know how long you guys have got to wait, but there's a lot of passengers waiting there. You say go plenty of times to get some photos. That's a fishing trawler. It's good thing this isn't in smell of vision, otherwise, uh, you could smell absolutely everything taking place. That was a really. <laughs> that was quite an elegant turn. Oh dear. Let's, is there anything coming up? Nope. Nah, nothing. Diddly squat. There's a crane there for DB. Okay. Not too long to go now before we can uh, disappear. We can get the show on the road. Oh, seagulls. I hear seagulls. I hear them, but I can't see them. They're mysterious. They work in mysterious ways. Okay, let's um, start bringing the brakes down in a second. There we go. Okay. There we go. Got some board at 1.35 miles. Let's bring that down now, and let's go into a quite substantial brake and bring that down to 10 miles per hour. There we go. So that's a DB crane up there, so is there actually a, a rail yard in there then? Well, that could certainly do with a, uh, a tidy up. Mess of lines everywhere. So, seeing as we've crossed that, I was going to say, are we going to go up to 60? Keep on the signals now, we're going to be chasing that 170. Mind you, he had a decent head start. No, it's just aggregacy off the lower door, isn't it? Plenty of people at work, it's good to see. Supporting the local economy.
<laughs> Is it worth it? Okay, let's see what we can do accuracy-wise when it comes to uh, stopping here. And I'll tell you what, that is excellent. Ooh, the bell. There's a pub. Tell you what, I'll hop out. I'll have a quick point, nip back in again, it will be golden. It will be absolutely golden. So if we go back here... Worst things to see. Okay. Plus with some nice residential areas. We should see what trains we pass. Three point three miles to go for our next station stop, and we're coming in early, so that's fine. But uh, we're not sticking to a timetable. We're literally just coming in. Open the doors, waiting for the guards to close whistle, and then that'll be that. So nothing, nothing terribly uh, difficult. It's just lengthy. Very, very picturesque ground here, must, must have been. I'm actually glad that this uh, scenario is in gorgeous uh, sunshine. Oh, blimey, well, look at the wobble there. That's, uh, how's the truck? Good grief. <laughs> Good grief. So, somebody in the Harlem shape all of a sudden. That was like a chump and a half. A bit slow on the second one there, but it's fine. Playing at this stage of proceedings. Oh, we've got a old chimney tower over there. The things you see when you're uh, when you're just browsing. Oh, cows.
30 miles an hour section there when we cross over the bridge. Okay, let's... We've got about a minute to play with, but I want to try and stay on time where possible. Yeah, I think we're fine. If we just keep coasting in, we'll be okay. Just going to be with the speed limit. Yep, that's the AWS. It's, you can't hear it externally, but uh, you, you saw the symbol there anyhow. See how we can do stopping here as well, then. Yep, I'm quite happy with that. Yeah, that's not bad, actually. So how's our rest of our train doing? Ooh, ooh, I tell you what, how close are we? <laughs> oh, we're right on the money. That is literally right on the cusp. I'll take that. Quite happily. Behind the yellow line, please, sir. That's my disapproval, aren't you? What is Jip that way? You there. There. Walk there. With your dodgy arm. There. Oh, Alright, ignore me then. No, you're all you're doing it. Alright. You'll be the ones that get the fines coming through the post, not me. I go see a doctor about that dodgy arm and all. Okay. Want us to no, it doesn't want us to stop at a uh, actual marker, whereas on the journey coming up, it did last time around. Now you can't see this, but I actually just did a symbol of coming to my chip. I had my hand, or both my hands, doing the symbol of coming towards me at the screen. Bearing in mind you can't see this, but I just did it. So down. I love these little crosses just going through fields. That is fantastic.
you know, just coasting in quite happily. There's no ETA, sorry, there's no actual departure time at this particular station, so I'm not too worried. need to make sure is that that carriage is completely in. Yep, I think that's fine. That's not a problem either, so we're good. And we just, you just wait here. Let's pop out. And we're going to sit just here. Lovely job. Six miles till we get to Reedham. Six miles, plenty of time. before we start rounding the corner on the approach into Reedham. slow down in just enough time. Another turbo coming up. So I'm going to sit this side, see if we can't uh, catch the number. And so we're due in two minutes early, so plenty of time. Put more boats. She comes. One seventy two seven three. Excellent. Okay, let's turn that down. Let's just up that just a little bit. I think we've actually got another bridge that we come over.
was, well, from this angle, I can't see. I could easily go to the to that one, and we can have a cheeky look. But where would the Quan be in there? Keep feather in the throttle and in some scenarios playing with the brakes. So you can hear the joyful sounds of the flange. Okay. Slowly working our way around as we approach Reedham. Still coming in early, so I don't have to worry about uh, trying to up the speed. I'll just let it roll in, to be fair. There's a uh, rolly. Okay, that's all fine and dandy. We might just roll back into 20 in just enough time. One of the old sidings. As long as we're doing 20.9, that's fine. I think I might actually have to do a little bit of uh, talking with the brakes. Oh, I don't know. No, I'm going to leave it. I'm not going to touch them. Oh. Oh. Come on. Drop down. Drop down. Drop. Yes. Okay. Now we can start braking. I want to test my theory. So we stop there. go to the back. Okay, so you can't actually get it fully in, but you can get the whole consist in. Okay. Well, better to know these things. So we've got a bit of a long... Oh, no, my, well, I say we've got a bit of a long way. I did actually get in early, so kind of I can hardly say it's a, uh, it's a long way when... I turned up early. It'd be different if I got here bang on time and then I had a long wait.
Okay, so that's when we now do to turn up, so let's see how long we'd actually be kept waiting here if we turned up, well, on time, basically. I can't imagine they'd have had you wait in here too long. No, no, not really. Just long enough. Okay, this is going to be a section of the track I haven't yet been on, so it'll be interesting to see what can be seen. Tractor over there. So we've got Candy in just two miles' time. Another tractor. It's over the side. Just a load of, uh, of greenery, not a problem. some sort of uh, industrial area. Plenty of cows. And sheep. Cows and sheep. Excellent. The world is already a much better place. in just over a minute early so again at this stage I will let you just roll her in quite easily so I yeah, just obviously this, this station is primarily to serve the people that work in this uh, factory double piece of track The, the railway used to serve this place then. Interesting. Yeah, that'll do, so we're happily in, we should release the double crossing. There we go, let's go to the back. Interestingly, it hasn't. Oh, hello, more parasols and trampolines and God knows what else. This is a very nice little station, this, I, I quite like it.
bring in still a decent waiting time. I don't quite know what he's doing there, but uh, there we go. is in 3.8 miles time. That's what I turned up for once. down, so coast for a while, and I've opened some cows. I thought we were going to be stopping at all the stations, but evidently not. So let's... Who's this, then? Oh, Buckingham. Oh, OK. I'm surprised. I thought um, it'd have a stopping there, but I guess... I don't know, maybe they just don't have these trains stop here, then. Unless that's a request stop isn't out of the realms of possibility. Okay, going up to Brundle. over there. Well, I'll be. That is very nice.
Okay, actually, ooh, we're running late. Ooh, okay. Let's, um, let's try and better this. We're running late, we can't have that. There's the line that takes you off to Great Yarmouth. Okay, we'll bring it to a stop there. Ten seconds late. I can live with ten seconds. How are we doing back here? Well, we got we got all three cars in, so I can take it. I wouldn't mind so much if you actually used the bridge, but you sort of just ghosted. It's going to be nightmares. And you, with your dodgy arm. Okay, there goes the whistle. Beans. More boats. Turbo coming in, Let's see where this is going and the number is. It's off to Great Yarmouth, it's 17270. Excellent. Let's sit back here. Looks like we haven't actually got a scheduled time for Bundle Gardens, so that's absolutely fine. Resting in quite nicely. Got a nice little uh, lakes around here. Okay, let's let's release that. Be a nice, gentle, controlled stop. So, let's go to the outside. We just want to ensure that uh, we get the VSO in. Okay, yeah, I think we can do good there. Yep, I'll take that quite happily. Okay, next stop is Norwich.
the, uh, the bridge. It's not uh, one of the scenic bridges, it's just a, a simple bridge. Yeah, the amount of braking we've applied <clears throat> should just be okay. But you'll see what I mean when we go past this bridge. It isn't exactly, you know, like the seventh wonder of the world. But I don't actually know why you'd have to go so slow over this in the first place. It genuinely doesn't actually make a world of sense to me. Someone clearly, uh, that's why, but I'm not privy to such information. I never am. I mean, you can see there, it's, it's literally it's just a, a bridge for a, for a road. It's, it's nothing tremendously exciting, all things considered. What it does mean is that we get to do this. Two miles to go. I think it's been quite a nice gentle run. Nothing too taxing. Very, very relaxing. <clears throat> okay, let's just be a bit more heavy on the brakes. See, so there's what 25 minute coming up, but the signal after this is going to be a red. So we're going to want to be prepared. Okay. 
So we've got another turbo coming down. If we keep coasting at a slow enough speed, the signal may change in our favour. What we will do, we're going to nip to this side. We've got 172.71 on a Greater Anglia service bound for lower stops. The signal has just changed, so I was right just to release the brakes. We'll keep the speed up briefly. Obviously you're aware that it's going to be a 15 minute coming up, so I'm not going to go too crazy. Okay, I'm going to turn that off. Just keep an eye out for the various signals around as there's Norwich Crown Point Depot. Let's start slowing down to the 15. Just make sure there's another turbo to passing. 172.73 up to about up to some far and distant land. Okay, looks like the signal ground signal is in our favour. The 25 limit. So we will just open the taps. Okay, let's just start applying some brakes. I think we could just about get this spot on. So let's just bring it up to about there, see if we can coast in. Let's see how close under this sort of brake. I'm not going to play with the brakes, let's see if we can get... I feel like we're going to go a bit too fast, so I may have to start playing. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, I have a word. I think that is a resounding success. Yeah. I'll take that. And we've got plenty of platform to play with. So when it came to the train departing up, you can give it what for. It looks like we've got a multitude of turbos. Shoot, Jesus. That, is that three, three cars? It is. It's a, th it's a, it's a, it's a three, three car load. There we go, excellent mode driver, everyone who needs to has got off, so all that's left to do now is to shunt the low level carriage sidings, to do this, wait for the signal to clear, go to signal, CO, switch ends, and then head into the sidings. Okay. A new aspect. Okay then. So we're going to hop out here. Of course, we have to keep an eye on these signals because obviously we've just had that uh, turbo, massive turbo depart. So we need to just keep an eye on the signals around here, wait for them to give us the clearance before we can proceed. What I may do, I may try something. Okay, we've been given approval to pass through. In fact, it's just changed now, so. We're just going to keep, we're just going to creep. Stage, we're going to creep. Okay. Let's 
let's just make sure that that isn't for us. It should be okay. Headlights are good. Yep. Right, so we release that. Go back here. I'm just going to keep that speed down. I don't want to go too gung ho because I just don't want to run through any signals, seeing as we're right at the, the crunch end of this. Oh, we're, we're doing our old weave over this side. Jolly good. Okay, so we're approaching this. So do I need to try just keep going or do I have to stop? What's the what's the, what's the game plan here? Do I keep going? No, I'll, I'll keep going and then I'll come to a stop inside the actual signal zone. So we'll release that. Okay. 0.3 of a mile. Can I zoom in? Can I actually see what's going on? Can I buggery? Never mind. Okay, fine. Let's just release that then. And then we'll come to a stop here. We shall now wait. Now switch ends and head into the low level. Okay. So, headlights should still be good. Yep, right, we're going to sit here. We are good to go. Let's release the brakes. Let's give it a bit of throttle. There we go. Okay. Just coasting in quite happily here, no pressure at all. Coming up alongside 17208 that will be off to London Liverpool Street. Just take my head out there with the uh, catenary masks and again. Badoop. Okay. Let's get a little bit further down. And let's just get some braking going just to bring it to a nice controlled stop. Excellent. That uh, is that done. Then it's going to give me some really wacky instruction to do. But I think that should be that. Excellent work, driver. That's the test run over with, and it was certainly a roaring success. That was a good pun. Quite literally. <laughs> All that's left to do now is to shut down the locos and then Scenario will exit itself in a minute's time. Actually, I can just... Uh... Just hold that off, wait for the RPMs to drop. Turn that off. That is that. The engines are shutting down. You can see the fan has stopped. The engines are off. Oh, hello. Impromptu train spotting required. 
Well done, you have completed the scenario successfully. As 17272 comes in with a termination service, are you going to stop? Are you going to stop? Just. Okay, that is that. That was a great little run. Thoroughly enjoyable, and that is a very, very nice route to, uh, to run on. Dead glad I did it. And uh, there's plenty more things that I can do. So we've got the bronze star there, so I can, uh, I'll have to open on that one. But you can see here we've got plenty more to do with the 37s. Different 37s, 422, 419, uh, 45 again, and 405. You've got Norwich Crown Point to Lowestoft, Lowestoft, Lowestoft to Norwich, and plenty of things to do. You've got the turbos to go on there. But uh, now that that's done, we're going to um, go back to the Settle Carlisle line where I had some troubles. Uh, we're not going to worry about those. What we can either do, we can do an up, we can do uphill struggles in the 37, or other 37s, or we can nip into the standard section of things. There we go. Plenty of there to do. So again, we can even do uh, steam trains along here which I could very well do. Uh, we've got some 37s, we've got some 66s that we can do. Uh, so what we are going to do, we're not going to worry about learning the ropes. Uh, the 158s are just a bit of a pig. What we're going to do, we're going to do, uh, we're going to have a look at this. A faulty H share wagon was dropped off at home and co-sidings due to a damaged axle. Retrieve the wagon from the sidings, and due to issue with the points in that direction, you'll have to perform several manoeuvres in order to gain access to the stricken wagon. That's going to be amazingly irritating. So what's up with the... What, <clears throat> what have we got here, then? Do -do -do -do. Yeah, okay. Tell you what, we'll do this. The Settle Carlisle line will be covered by a 37, EWS 37, for a midwinter rescue. That's what we will we'll do next and then um, after that we're going to hit the east coast main line uh, we are going to do we have to go into career we'll probably cover one that I've done already do, 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 do. try I, I, will, I will look at those later and see if I can't work out what's going on uh, what we're going to do is we're going to do the staff train in a 365. That's what we'll do for the East Coast Main Line one, and then we should go from there. But if you guys have any routes you'd like to see me do, or uh, trains you'd like to see me drive, then please do let me know, and I shall uh, do my very best. Just please be aware of the Class 91 and the 315 I'm currently experiencing issue with, so they won't be happening for the time being. Uh, if you'd like to help support the channel and... Um, uh, you can do so by donating through PayPal. Any and all funds go straight back in and uh, will be used for purchasing new content for this uh, as well as other aspects of my channel. So, until next time, I shall see you all later. Take care, guys. Goodbye.